One of the remarkable features and benefits of the Apple Watch is viewing and responding to your messages quickly. The quickest replies aren't the ones dictated or typed, but using the default replies feature. Default replies allows you to send preset messages with one tap. In addition, you can edit the list and add your own responses for more convenient messaging on your Apple Watch. Welcome to Ellen's Tips for iOS, where I help seniors master their iPhones and iPads. If you find value in these videos, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and turn on that notification bell so you never miss when a new video is posted. After watching the video, check out the resource guide in the video description and sign up for notifications of when I'm going live. Let's get started. When you receive a message notification on your Apple Watch, you'll see a little red dot at the top of the screen. I'm going to go ahead and open my watch so you can see that. You'll see the little red dot. Go ahead and swipe down from the top of the screen and you'll see the notifications listed there on your uh, watch. So I'm going to tap into the message notification that I received to expand that message. And you'll see that you can uh, tap into the iMessage area where you would be able to use the microphone to dictate a text. You could also write in this area with your finger or use an emoji. I'm gonna go ahead and cancel out of that for a second. And I'm gonna swipe down below iMessage and suggestions and now you'll see where the default replies are located. And this is where you can send an immediate default reply by just tapping on it. So the suggestions are going to give you an idea of, you know, whatever the message says, it's going to kind of respond accordingly. So the message said, let's get together soon. And I can reply with, okay, that sounds good. And that message will be sent immediately to the recipient. Your Apple Watch offers many pre-made responses for you, but you can also add your own custom responses. And to do that, you need to come into the Watch app. So let me pull down on the screen and I've already typed in Watch. And so you'll see the Watch app. I'll tap to open that and then scroll down until you see messages and now tap on default replies and at the very bottom you'll see the option to add a reply. I'll go ahead and tap on that and then I'll just type in see you soon and I'll tap on the back button at the top of the screen and now that default reply will show up under the iMessage suggestion area on my Apple Watch. When you create a customized message, it ends up at the bottom of the replies area. You can move it to the top or anywhere on the list. And to do that, you'll tap on the edit and then using the handlebars next to the message, just drag the message to where you want it to be. You can also rearrange uh, the pre-made messages. They're already there. And when you're finished, you'll go ahead and tap on done. If you have smart replies enabled, your custom message will not appear at the top of the list on your Apple Watch. Smart replies prioritizes the responses it believes you want to use based on the message that you received. You can disable the smart reply feature by just toggling off the switch and then you can rearrange your custom messages in the order that you want them to be. To edit or remove a custom response, you'll want to open the watch app. So I'll pull down on the screen. I started to type in watch. I'll tap on the watch app. I'll tap on messages. I'll tap on default replies. And then once we get into this area to edit a response, go ahead and tap on edit in the upper right corner, tap into the area of the response, change the response to what you want it to be, and then go ahead and tap on done. 
if you want to remove a message, the same applies. You come back into this area, tap on edit, tap on the little red minus sign next to the message you want removed, and then go ahead and tap on delete. When you receive a text on your Apple Watch, you'll go ahead and tap on the message, and then you'll scroll down until you see suggestions. And because I have smart uh, replies turned on, I need to scroll past the smart replies, and then I'll see the custom message that I created. I can go ahead and tap on that custom message, and it will be sent to the recipient immediately. Setting up and using custom text message replies on your Apple Watch is simple. It will allow you to respond quickly to any text message you receive on the go. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.